Hey guys, just out here in the desert, measuring voltage and frequency. So I've had a lot of people say, well, you know, you're, if you go out in the middle of nowhere, uh, you're not gonna get anything in the, in the ground, only in the city. Well, we're out here, I'm, I've got a probe over here. I've got a probe over there. I'm using a fluke scope meter. And this scope meter is telling me that there are voltage, there is voltage and there are frequencies in the ground, in the earth. And this isn't a special spot. There's actually, it's pretty low here. Um, from, you know, we're, we're, we'll be clipping in a, in a second, I'm sure, because I've seen all kinds of crap going through it, but the earth is not zero. And people have been out there showing you that a voltmeter connected to the same spot, you know, shows you that, oh, look, you're, you're safe. It's zero. That's, that's a bunch of garbage. I don't know who brought that up or who made it, but anybody that uses that is not an electrical engineer. That's for sure. It's not taught in any electrical literature. Look at this. So... Your, your EMF expert told you to connect your ground sheet or your earthing sheet to the earth. And this is what you would be getting in your body. These are known, these frequencies are known to open up potassium and sodium ion channels. They clearly don't know what they're talking about. If somebody told you to, look at this, there's some sort of communication happening right now. I'm going to zoom out a little bit. 50 millivolts, there we go. And it's not the same thing. It's maybe this, this is power line communications. I don't know. But I do know that this is in the kilohertz frequency range. And the NIEHS says that anything over one millivolt of internal electric fields is associated with cancer. So now you've connected your earthing sheet to these frequencies and you're going to be getting more than one millivolt. I guarantee you that. All right. Hope you enjoyed the video. Have a great day.